Hey everybody, Casey here. Welcome back to The Simpsons Tapped Out. Hopefully, another premium character for you in the Yearbook Mystery Box. And this character, well, you can see in front of you a lot of gold. That is a very, very strong hint as to the character I'm going to be getting. The character is going to be JG, which comes with obviously the character, Massive Mansion, and a goose. We've also got Frink's Mechano Spider, Snake Eating Rudolph, Limo, and Gorilla and Balloons. So that creates some pretty cool decorations in this category, but obviously I like to go for the first one. Frink's Mechano Spider. Whoa. I did not realize the size of the spider. Now, if memory serves me correctly, I think this is supposed to be a parody of that Wild West movie with Will Smith. Dang. That's pretty neat looking. It's gonna sound like just a mechanical engine, I think. It can't sound like a spider because it's obviously not real. So we'll go with just a mechanical engine. A little bit of an animation with the really bad smoke coming up from the top. Ooh. Yo, Professor, what is that thing? Tremble for my steampunk arachno monstrosity. It's steam powered? Why would you ever choose steam as a power source? Because it's scarier this way. Maybe I'm not getting this. What is scary about utilizing outmoded technology? I'll squash you for that. You don't want to mess with him, man. Snake Assault Frink's Mechano Spider. What? Frink work the controls. <laughs> Six hour quest. Dude, that's harsh. <laughs> oh, yes. I, I'm a geek. And it's animated. Oh, good, Glazen. This bumped up my curiosity leaps and bounds. So for the animation for Professor Frank, I'm going to assume that they're going to be in that little box thingy. And I don't see any controls. But I'm going to assume there's some way to control that. Maybe he's got like a, a handheld one or something. Handheld control thingy. So I'm gonna go with them in the box. And him controlling it. And here he comes. That's pretty cool, man. Here comes, um, what's his name? I'm really liking it. Got the limo. And I apparently have a limousine already, or a very similar one. Well, shucks, I screwed that up. Let's try that again. God damn it, I like this one better. I don't even remember what it's from. Inflatable Gorilla and Balloons. I'm trying to remember what this one is from. Is this is this the one where Homer buys that motorhome? And then Bart and Lisa have to return it and then it's like, oh, look for the monkey at the top. Or is this like a Christmas thing? I want to say it was Christmas related. Well, that's not what I meant to tap. Oh, his butt! Look at the butt! Clearly it's supposed to be like Rudolph, but instead of its nose, it's his butt! That's so cute! It is cute, by the way, I don't know why, I just think it is. 
So there's a permanent animation with the flashing butt. Uh, I got a 50% chance of either getting JD or the snake eating Rudolph. There we go, finally. Man, oh man, oh man, and man, oh man, what in the heck? It comes with a pirate ship. Are you kidding me? This is insane. Oh God, hello. Stop moving on me, please. Ooh, a premium character. You will never be truly ruthless until you destroy the ones who made you. JG! Hey, you! Does anyone know who that is? Honk! Gooseyus! Of course it's Mr. Burns, because this was, I think, a one hour long episode, if I remember. This is pretty unbelievable. Got a bit of a shine, a massive shine with the golden, I guess, staircase thingy. Cool pirate ship, more bling. I don't know what this is gonna sound like, but I know he was a rapper in the episode, so I'm gonna assume some kind of rap music. I'm gonna go with rap music when I tap it. I mean, I'm sure they've used gooses in rap music, so I, I win. Laying Golden Records. What about the pirate ship? It is two separate animations! And then of course the champagne. Your passionate grasping is inspiring, but to truly master the ladder to loot, you have to push others down as you pull yourself up. So wise, where do I begin, Monty? Still with your own employees, you know what they say, cruelty begins at home. Yeah, I don't think I've ever heard that before. Burns torment power plant workers, that's not funny, why am I laughing? And JGB mentored, Fear is the aspiring ludocrat's greatest tool. For example, spreading a rumor that you're going to downsize will motivate employees to work both harder and accept lower pay. I like the ring of that rung, Monty. How'd you get to be so street? I'm a Springfield OG, octogenarian grouch. Word. Two words, actually, but I take your point. The next rung is to realize ruthlessness never rests. There are opportunities for malevolence in every situation, including a lovely dinner out with a friend. What are you thinking, Monty? Should we stiff them on the tip? Run out the check? Both? Excellent idea, Jay. You're zooming up the ladder, and for an extra larf, we can harass the staff before we stiff them. Well, this is going this is going very interestingly, isn't it? Harass the wait staff. What? Hmm. Okay, I'm really curious what restaurant you would be going to. It would have to be a fancy restaurant like the Gilded Truffle or something. No. He's going to a pizza place. Although the animation looks pretty dang amazing as well. Vesuvius Pizza. <laughs> the waiter quit, the hostess cried, and the busboy tried to drown himself in his dish bucket. I call that a successful evening. To tell the truth, I felt a little bit sorry when the hostess started to cry, because I knew that sooner or later she was going to stop. Mocking your victims is suffering. You've mastered another rung. This is horrible! JG can become the next Mr. Burns. What? It is important not to lose sight of the basics. Ruthlessness should be fun. If you're not having a good time at someone else's expense, you're doing it wrong. 
How do you keep the evil popping when you're just hanging on the corner? A degrading jape is never more than a dollar away. Watch you manipulate the greed of someone less fortunate. Is it Homer? Make Burns and JG glue money to the pavement. Excellent. I'm just curious just where that's going to be glued. You know, I'm asking for a friend and all. I wish that would have been animated. That would have been kind of fun. <laughs> there, right in the natural sight line of the broken down sidewalk stair. Here comes the sucker now. Looks like he's wearing Will Lomond hand-me-downs. A dollar! Holy moly! This is a break I've been waiting for. Things are going to be turning around now. Ah, the old sidewalk stickeroo. Should have known. Third time this week. Guiding you up these ruthless rungs have really tucked me out. I barely have the strength to tent my fingers. Let's go chill at my crib. You can rebuild your energy by terrorizing my staff. That sounds delightful. I really am more of a tormentor than a mentor anyway. Now we're talking. Go to JG's mansion. <coughs> this animation is really, really curious for me. Mainly because of the fact that there's just so much going on at that place. It's going to be a bit of a walk, so I have time to think it over. I'm going to assume that it's going to be just in the, the actual mansion itself, not the backyard. So for the animation, I think it would be obvious to go with the light turning on, the smoke going up. Yeah, That's all I can really see. Wait, I've got another option. The fountain is also going to turn on. So we're going to have the lights turn on, the smoke, and we're going to have the fountain. Here he comes! Whoa, we got, we got some lights! Flashing lights! Yellow and blue. We got puffs of smoke. We got a blinging bird at the top. Jamming to the music. And I think that's it. There's nothing in the backyard I can see. I think the flight was always waving. I think. Actually, I'm not even sure anymore. And I was wrong about the fountain. And the smoke. So I was kind of right with the lights, except they flash. Excellent. Congratulations, Jay. You reached the top rung of the ladder to loot. You're like the sun I never had. And far better than the sun I did have, but never see. And you're like the father I never muscled out of his own recording label and then framed for bank robbery. And now, we must destroy each other. I wouldn't have it any other way. So Mr. Burns taught Jay the ways to be evil. And now they're just gonna go after each other. Now we gotta look at some of the animations for Jay. We've got Make It Rain and Feed Gooseyus. I actually kind of forgot about the goose. Only until I clicked the building and then it sounded like the goose. But Make It Rain, hold on, we gotta get him to just kind of clear here. Making It Rain. I'm not surprised by the animation, but I like it. Poor Gil. Why couldn't he be around now? You know what I mean? No, Blinky! Oh, poor Blinky. He, he done got it, man. This one I really, really like because of the fact that they walk around. And then JG feeds unlimited Blinkies to Gooseyus. I think so. He's probably not hungry. That's probably why. But the feeding to come soon though. Well, we'll see if the feeding does continue. But I am going to wrap up the video here. The quest line was really, really fun. There's so much that you get with this bundle. If I remember when it came out, it must have been at least a couple hundred. Oh! The feeding continues. 
Yeah, I believe this was at least a couple hundred donuts. I want to say it was even maybe like 300 donuts. I could be mistaken. I want to say this is probably some kind of guild deal down the road. It's been a while though. I can't really remember the specifics of it. But I know it's pretty expensive. But you do get JG. You do get this insane mansion with the backyard. And you get Gooseyus. Gooseyus, I think, is just there with them. The question is, is Gooseyus just an NPC? Or does he only pop up? with that animation. In fact, I'm going to check really quickly. Because all I got to do is go to here and go to Gooseyus if they're there. C, D, E, F, G. No, there's no Gooseyus. So Gooseyus is not a separate character. I wasn't sure if they were or not. It looks like Goosey is just only going to pop up when you see, what's his name? JG in the animation. So I've lost them, unfortunately, but that is all good. No, I found him again. And I'll see you with more premium character walkthroughs in the future. So thank you everybody so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye, everybody.